We play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome to the Freak Show. I am your host, Bumpy McSquiggums, and today we're going to be diving in, doing something a bit different than my normal fare. We're going to be uh, dusting off the old platforming, murder, death, killing skills that I totally have and haven't lost, you know, 20 years ago. <clears throat> and we're going to be diving in and checking out Getsu Fumiden Undying Moon. And, uh, yeah, Konami, or as apparently I wrote down, Konamo, because I, I, don't, I don't have a reason... Uh, Konami makes a rare appearance, and um, yeah, they sent a code my way for this game. There's even a link down below at the top line of the description if you guys would be so kind as to use that if you're going to grab the game on Steam, as it will redirect you to Steam and helps them, you know, keep track of the traffic that I drive toward their title. So, again, if you're going to go check out the game, make sure you use that link to do so. And yeah, it released on February 16th, 2022, and uh, I'm here for it. It looks very interesting. I, I guess the the it's like um it's like a very art driven. I, I don't know. I don't know how to really explain it. It's it's gonna be cool. I think it's gonna be really really fun. Uh, I've not played it yet myself, so we're gonna be diving in blind for the very first time. Apparently, I have eight records in which to try not to kill myself with. Uh, we have the Apprentice difficulty. Uh, it is a, a difficulty setting geared for beginners. Gameplay is easier with fewer stages and weaker enemies. Fewer stages? Hmm. A basic difficulty for players familiar with action games. Gameplay is casual, but still provides a challenge. Those are the only two options we have. I, I You know, I might be a commoner. I might be slightly above a commoner, but we'll, we'll give it a shot. You can change difficulties after starting the game. Okay. I assume if we're able to beat it and defeat it and be amazing, we might be able to unlock additional difficulties. I don't know. But either way, let's see what we're getting ourselves into. But you see, it's like a very stylized, almost like a painting-esque scenario. Shrine Maiden, with the seal upon hell undone, the world may soon meet its end. Do I get to advance? No, it's auto-advance. All right. Getsu Fuma. Just dot dot dot. Do you still not know of my brother's whereabouts? Clan members have been... Sent to search for him, but his location is still unknown. My throat tried to kill me there. It's not great. Then I shall do this myself. You are the one chosen to lead the clan. Thus, the task of dealing with this cataclysm falls upon you. Yes, I'll go at once. Oh, just all right. Prepare yourself. I, I like how there's just like this jutting area we can go stand and look down at this stuff. Also, that looked like a horrible little uh, dealie down there. Oh my goodness! Look at all this stuff. Oh, they're just going to immediately throw me in against an enemy, huh? Attack with your main weapon. Oh my goodness, I just did so... Oh my... Wow, this really is bloody. Now, what did this, uh... Perform a unique move? Is that like a parry move? Looks like it. Oh, and then I can... I, I, I can apparently change weapons? Is that a thing? I want, my sword looks real raggedy. Uh... Press and dismantle, hold to acquire, attack 70. Do, do we have a, a, a basis of comparison here? I mean, I can acquire. Oh, okay, okay. I acquire, oh. Yeah. I have an umbrella, what? <laughs> hold on, wait, wait, wait. Wait, like we definitely got like a different weapon, right? Or was the umbrella what we picked up? Maybe, maybe the umbrella is what we picked up. I, I wasn't really looking at the picture. I thought it was a sword. It's an umbrella, apparently. All right. Well, hold on, hold on. W which one's actually strong? Okay, the sword is stronger. Teachings of battle. Okay. Yeah. And now there's a bow. Sub weapons. In addition to a main weapon, players can equip up to two sub weapons at a time. Okay. Limited ammunition and cooldown timers apply to sub-weapons so they cannot be used in rapid succession. However, they have special attacks such as the ability to attack from afar, enhance your character, and more. Find the perfect pairing of your main weapon to help you work through the game. Uh, how does one use the... Oh. Oh. Okay. Right. okay. What this? Jump? Yeah. Oh, we, could, yeah. we got a little little air stomp. Yeah. All right, I'm here for it. Yeah. One to open. 
I got a mirror. It's got a tremendous amount of attack. And Soul Devour. Uh, acquiring a soul will cause your Soul Devour counter to increase. Using Soul Steel will provide enchantments, or sorry, enhancements according to the number of souls used. Huh. Enhanced abilities will be reset if you return to the Getsu Clan estate. You can only hold up to four souls at a time. Acquiring a fifth will give you three soul memories and return your Soul Devour counter to one. Is that is that a good thing? When enhancing main and sub weapons with Soul Devour, enhancement bonuses based on the weapon's distinctive quality will occur. What does that mean? Enhanced Vitality will raise your maximum vitality. Healing Potion plus one will cause you to drop a healing potion where you stand. Carefully choose how you enhance your character to efficiently proceed through the game. Oh, well this seems like all sorts of ways for me to mess myself up. Oh. Oh, was there was there some other choice? Use my sub weapon. Oh, that didn't work. Oh, that worked really well that time though. Dodge. Okay. I'm not ready to descend. I got somebody up top I need to go hang out with. Uh oh. Oh no. I can only assume I will hurt myself. Catch. All right. Well, I guess that felt good. Yeah. We. Can we can we run by like double tapping something? No. We're holding the. Uh, nope. Okay. We're just moving the speed. That's fine. Roll through. All right. Cool. 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 I like it. I like it. Uh, transform with combo attacks. What? Uh, and combo attacking. I mean, I feel like I didn't transform. What do they mean by transform? We don't have a lot of the... I mean, I don't feel like I'm transforming. Alright, well, uh, you know what? It's fine. We'll figure it out as we go. What this? Proceed to the... Oh, okay. Uh, stage progress and equipment will be lost, but all items will be brought back. Oh. I guess that was my soul devourer uh, undevouring itself. The journey begins. We're on fire. That's probably not great for us. Maybe it's, it's a real bad case of indigestion. I don't know. So what, what what do I do if I go over here? Just okay. Just kind of look around. See, like the, the game has just got this really awesome stylized. Like I said, it, it feels almost like a painting. Oh, look at all those weird things up there. All the little pictures. Or items, maybe? Maybe they're items. Select difficulty. Uh, change the game's difficulty at the training statue. Different enemy or elements are added in each difficulty to make the game more uh, challenging. Difficulties are unlocked when you obtain items of proof. Seek out proof of your strength and challenge even more powerful enemies. Oh, that's cool. Alright, well, I'm staying on commoner. It is important to know when to retreat. Yeah, no, I, I agree. Oh. I'll just pick my weapon back up and... Can, please tell me I can't murder her. Okay. I was getting a little where I'm like, hmm. Wait, that's it? Just the one sword? I don't get any other options? Look, the umbrella's right there. Let me take it. Uh, all right. Okay. Oh, oh. Oh, you, you creepy boy. I, 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 huh. Ooh, I got an eyeball. Unavailable. Why is this unavailable? 
Probably because it might be like a harder difficulty. Oh gosh, things look so terrifying here, don't they? Oh, I hit the wrong button. Absolutely getting worked by this guy. Uh oh. Oh, he, he upset. Okay. Kind of getting kind of getting my feel. Yeah, I got beat up real bad there. I was, I was hitting R1 for some reason to, like, uh... I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. R1 to try to dodge, which I knew wasn't dodge. I don't, I don't know what I was doing. It was weird. Can I go back to town right away? No, I can't. Alright, I'm stuck here now. Alright. I was like, can we, can we just have like a, can we have a, a do-over? I feel like a do-over would be real nice right about now. Apparently no. No do-overs. Bad Bumpy is bad. Gonna have to live with being Bad Bumpy. I guess I'm okay with that. Okay, mystical hollow tree of, of uh, ghostly attitude. I like, I kind of want to try that. Oh, it worked. Worked really well, actually. I think I still took the hit, though. Right? I still got hit. But I just, like, counterattack? Uh, mm. Alright. Rolling through. Chug another potion. There's a treasure chest down here. What do we got? All right. All sorts of stuff. And the unyielding gauntlets of gauntitude. Oh, I can punch stuff now. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Definitely weaker than what I had. All right. Ooh. I'll take some kunai. So, oh. I I was busy. Can you not chuck stuff through the terrain again, please? I is he good? I descended into hell on orders to find the root cause of these wicked creatures, but I abandoned my descent into the deepest depths, where I must return alive with what tidings I may. I sense a great power down there, but I know not what it is. So we of course go the other direction to nothing. Alright. Alright, Mr. Great Power. Great responsibility. Oh, we might have obliterated him if I that guy. What's up, buddy? Ah! Oh, it poisons him. That's pretty cool. Can I have your sword? No. All right. Well, let's go to the right. All right. Took care of. Uh, oh. uh, I don't. That's got four. Attack 32, attack 61. All right, we're going to press and hold to dismantle this. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. I do did not stand much of a chance. Um, am I supposed to continue to go up at this point? Yeah. Like I'm here, I'm yeah. doing it. I feel like we're we're definitely yeah. making you know headway, but I also am a little worried that we might have gone the wrong way. Oh, now this looks this looks pretty good. Teachings of destruction, determination F, uh, but the attack is plus A or B. This is F, the nameless katana. Ah, uh, you know what? Let's try the keen spear. Get rid of the katana. We may immediately regret this. We are used to fighting with it. Oh, uh, this is a challenge level, I can only assume. Oh, nope. It's a shop. 
raise weapon rank, activation, main weapon, sub weapon. Also, how do I? I got the soul thing. How do I change what my my soul thing is? Well, I, I guess I used it. I got more health now. Oh my god, 282. I immediately have fallen in love with this. We have a lot of money, so we can actually afford these things. You don't speak. Uh, I mean, they're not giving it a lot of love. Oh, the, the rusted chain is incredible, too. Yeah. All right, I'm purchasing this. We're taking over the gauntlet. Oh, no. Uh, so, apparently getting the club gave me a fatal error, which is not great. Well, we'll continue from wherever they let us continue. Oh, all the way from the start of the level, huh? All right, we're back at the shop. Uh, I already have a club now, so I don't know that I necessarily need another one. Uh, I guess we can go with the rusted chain. And we'll swap the katana for it? All right, doesn't seem to be crashing this time. Activation, main weapon, sub weapon, raise weapon rank. Raising equipment rank. Raising the ranks of equipment co uh, costs soul memories and coins. The higher the rank, the stronger its stats, including base attack. Uh, do we, we, we have a little bit of something? Uh, raise, oh, oh, we need more than we have. Okay, well, that's fine. And uh, apparently there's a bit of RNG-ness to the game uh, as a whole, so uh, we got some different uh, situations this time around as opposed to last time. Uh, not a lot of comboing with these two weapons, to be honest. I think maybe I'll switch back over to this for now. If need be, we can always return. There is still some stuff down below in the other place that we didn't go. Here we go. Uh, a new bow, 145 attack versus a 106. Absolutely going to do it. I, I think that means we should then probably dismantle this. All right. Now, do keep in mind, folks, the game probably isn't going to crash for everyone. But with recording and everything else that's going on at any given time from... Uh, a, a content creator's computer, there's always a chance that weird things are going to happen and stuff is not 100% going to work the way uh, the person might hope. He didn't blow himself up, though. Ooh. I'm trying really hard not to let him even pick up a rock, but I'm just bailing at this. All right, next uh, teleportation thing we find, we're going to teleport to a different spot. Oh, that is a really good club. We hit pretty good from over here, though. Oh, we got another one of those boys. I, I definitely got my butt whooped a little bit more this time around than I did the first time around. Which is slightly, oh, slightly embarrassing. Come on. Here, you don't want to hold this. Yeah, you didn't like that, did you? Uh, the attack with this weapon is incredibly slow, and I think that's part of the problem there. Uh. Is this one of those mystical uh, soul things that I need to upgrade my weaponry and whatnot? Oh gosh. Here, hold this. Why, why mess around when I can just chuck a weird uh, spiky ball at a guy, right? Alright, fa oops. Fast travel. Yeah, well, you know what? We're kind of on that same plane as we were before. Alright, you know what? Well, it's fine. Let's go this way. Alright, I do love the fact that we do seem to have a map. Do we have a map? Yes, we do. All the time. We're in the land of limbo right now. Uh, I guess uh, how low can you go, right? Uh, we, we've been up this path before. Okay, so this is basically where we decided to go up instead of down. 
the last deal. And it looks like there's some treasure loot to be had. Ooh, a shiny sword. Versus our ghetto sword. Oh, this is definitely better. The nameless katana versus a keen katana, huh? That's just that's just a flat upgrade. Absolutely gonna take that. We're gonna trash our old piece of garbage. Yeah. I mean, you know, our our trusty old sword that we knew exactly the weight and feel. We're really comfortable using. Yeah, we're just gonna get rid of that. Oh god. Gotta stop doing that. I jump panic like all the time, apparently. That didn't work at all, I had planned. Surprise. Did you enjoy the uh Did you enjoy the uh, multitude of arrows in your spine? I mean I liked it, uh from my from my standpoint anyway. I mean we can look. No, nah, it's it's not as good. I'm sorry, but you are the weakest link. Alright, so it's gone. And this goes for like a while in various different directions. I hope I get some more uh, healing soon, because you know, my dumb butt has made too many mistakes at this point. I don't know how to select the uh, things at the bottom. Because I would probably go with more HP. Or if the random souls that we're getting have a specific thing that they can do. What is this? Proceed. Is this like a way through or out or to a boss fight or something? I don't know. Got him. Oh, he dropped a, ooh, a new one of these. This one's significantly slightly better. I mean there's there's no real downside to it, so let's just take it and toss this one in the old dumpster. I mean I'd like to continue to fully explore, and I may do that. Uh, again, in hopes that I can find something to heal me, really. That's what it comes down to. There's a teleporter above my head somewhere, I believe. Yep, there it is. Alright, so let's fast travel back over here. Okay. Oh, uh, let's switch back over to my weird chain attack thing. Oh, you thought that was fun? Here, hold this. I really like that. It's just like, it's just the slow, inevitable, you know, you, you lob it, you see it coming. It's that slow, inevitable death, you know, you're like, yep. Mm -hmm. They are going to regret this. Now, what what's going on down here? Yeah. Why are there little pools of, uh, doesn't seem to hurt me. Why are they red, though? Yeah. That's weird. Like, I kind of want to keep that, but eh. I didn't know if I could actually do anything with that. Alright, this looks like this is the next logical place to continue. Just heading up and to the right. Nope, we gotta go further up. I didn't go far enough up. Apologies! Oh no, that's... that. Okay, no, that was literally it, huh? Alright. So we literally did the the whole map, and okay, that's where the exit's at. All right, well that's cool. I didn't realize that that was completely finished. I thought there was another spot to go, obviously, and obviously I was wrong. Yeah. All right. Well, let's go see what a horrible thing yeah. is going to transpire here. Oh, oh, this does not bode. This does not bode well yeah. for me. Well, that was cool. Hello? Anyone here? Can I have some healing? Uh oh, oh god. Oh, it's Skeletor. Oh, I'm 100% I'm gonna die. Hundred percent not gonna be alive anymore. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Yep. That went well. Yeah. Uh
Oh, that still hit me even though I was nowhere near it. Okay, that's fine. I get it. Oh god, what is he doing? Oh jeez. I I dodged it, but uh, though your body may be destroyed, your soul and memory shall be eternally reincarnated. Well, I mean that was interesting, and I was definitely low on health. I <laughs> I felt I felt a bit uh, uneasy about that battle anyway. I think I set myself up for failure on that one. All right, let's go take a quick peek. What happens now? I can acquire my nameless katana. What's this? Proceed to the Hall of Treasures. Battle record. Okay. I feel like there's not a lot of treasure here. Just things that I've battled so far? Okay. How does your body fare? Well, I mean, I've definitely seen some better things. We can train. There's some secret arts. Forge and unlock. Well, okay. Refinement. Do you? I mean, th this is kind of the whole nature of the game, right? You're going to be going through. You're going to be doing stuff. You're going to die. You're going to come back and get, you know, additional things to help you become stronger and so on and so forth. You know, roguelike elements in a, a platform, action platformer, I guess. So, yeah, you know, I like it. I like it. Refinement. Uh, to use the refinement and unlock skill features, you must have the necessary materials. Makes sense. In refinement, you will also need relevant armor, scrolls, and di diagram. Once a main weapon or sub-weapon has been refined, there's a chance it will appear randomly in the rest of the game. Oh, nice. Unlock skill will reveal hidden skills for refined main weapons and sub-weapons. Activate unlock skills for a variety of effects. Okay. Skills must be unlocked in order. You cannot unlock a skill unless the previous one has been unlocked. Sure. Increase your capabilities. Aim to collect diagrams and materials as you play through stages. So we have the katana. We have the keen katana. Activation. Activate the unlock skills of uh, main weapons and sub weapons to use a variety of abilities. Activation will reset when you return to the Getsu clan estate. Activating one skill uses one soul memory. You cannot activate a skill unless the previous one has been activated. Soul memories are located throughout the stage. It cannot be acquired from enemies or treasure boxes. The amount you can obtain is limited, so be strategic with which skills you choose to activate. Huh. Teachings of Destruction, Break Attack. Uh, how many do we have? cost nine we only have one we can't do any of this uh this is already unlocked all right yeah can can we at least like switch our weapon forge weapons i guess this is where we can switch our weapons huh oh these are all sorts of uh okay there's a musket that's fascinating Well, this is, uh, this seems to, hmm. Main weapon. I went to forge, right? Oh, forge weapons and unlock skills. Okay. Train, training. Training will be permanently, will permanently enhance your six base abilities. Oh, okay. Uh, life is your base stat for vitality. Technique is a damage multiplier. Uh, break damage multiplier. Flash increases damage multiplier when flash is successful. I guess that's your uh, your counterattack. Stealth increases break damage multiplier when a surprise attack is successful. And impact base for stomp damage. A certain number of spirit minerals training are required for enhancement. And some also require armor scrolls. Uh, training manual. Find them and enhance your abilities. Okay, I assume we just... Do not have what we need for that. And Secret Arts, finally. There are plenty of additional abilities unlocked with Mastery. These unlocked abilities have a permanent effect. A certain number of Spirit min uh, Minerals Master are required for enhancement. Some also require Armor Mastery books. Find them to unlock. Alright, still, I think that's, that's fine. I, I like the idea. Oh my god. The Spiny Punisher. I am here for it. 
I now have a two O weapons to go and get myself into trouble with again. Anyway, guys and gals, that's going to do it for this first episode. I'm sure you were knowing that I was going to fail. I mean, the, the whole uh, the whole unfortunate crash event kind of threw any kind of semblance of whatever I was doing a little bit out of whack, and then I kind of rushed through to get back there. Left myself in a slightly worse position, but I don't think that mattered. I think I would have probably fallen flat on my face regardless, going against a big old skelly boss. But that's all good. It's all good. I had fun. Hopefully you guys did as well. There will be more to come on the channel. A big thank you once again to Konami for hooking me up with the code for this. And make sure, guys and gals, if you're going to go grab the game on Steam, to use the link at the top of the description down below to grab it as it will track everything and make Konami go, Hey, Bumpy, thank you. And I'll be like, love you, Konami. And then, you know, that whole relationship gets to build. Anyway, folks, if you want more information about the game, where to get the game, again, link at the top of the description. Uh, more information on the developer, so on and so forth. It'll all be down below in the various links in the description of the video. So, you guys know the score. Anyway, folks, until the very next episode, I've been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by The Freak Show. We play, we fight, we conquer.